Hey guys, I hope everybody is doing well today. I just wanted to do a really quick video this morning. There's been so much on my heart lately. Uh, one of the main things is, is I just, I am praying and praying and praying that all the prodigal sons and daughters would come home. Today is the day. Today is the day to reunite yourself with Jesus. He is calling you to come home. He has open arms to you. It doesn't matter where you've been. It doesn't matter how, how far you've gone. He is the forgiver of all. He's the redeemer of all. And he loves you. Come back to him. You know, I'm reminded today in John 4 where Jesus and the disciples are traveling. And Jesus goes way out of his way to meet the Samaritan woman at the well. And as you continue on down in John 4, you'll realize that he says, you know, they're drawing water from the well and he asks for a drink. But then he tells the Samaritan woman that once she takes a drink of what the, you know, the water that he gives, she will thirst no more. So the challenge to you guys today is to come to the well, drink of the water and you will thirst no more. This world has nothing for you. Every single thing that you thirst for, it's not going to provide. It's not going to provide. Only Jesus. Come to the Father today. Jesus, it's in John 14 and 6 says, He is the way, the truth, and the life. And nobody comes to the Father except through Him, except Jesus today. Guys, the gospel never gets old. I, the Speaking about the gospel, spreading the good news, it never gets old. Jesus never gets old. I am telling you, if you don't know Him, read John 3, 16. Read Romans 10, 9 through 13. Read 1 Corinthians 15, 1 through 4. Ephesians 2, 8 and 9. I can go on and on and on and on. Jesus is for you. He's not against you. He loves you. Just come to the well today and you'll thirst no more.